Can I say that on television? No, you can't. Oh, well, we we're, uh, we're on late enough, if I may uh, steal a quote from, oh, you know, well, what's his name? The what? world TV title holder. That is the man with the most massive torso in all pro wrestling, Onyx. And Crew Jones either having a muscular disorder or trying to mimic Onyx, which will come back and bite him on the butt within any second now. Well, Onyx has been on a great track record of world television title defenses. And yes, fans, it is the world television title. Any detractors, kiss our white asses. Well, my white ass, but Onyx no, is but, isn't. But not but right now, we're Nevertheless, busy. look at Onyx. Don't try a power game with Onyx. You can't win. Not a single superstar here at the wild side dressing room can even touch Onyx when it comes to power. Well, Onyx was a um, starting player for the uh, Western Carolina University football team for four years. Actually went on to play in the Canadian Football League professionally. I don't know how well that stands up to the um, five touchdowns scored in the high school game of Crew Jones, but nevertheless, I'm, I'm starting to doubt the existence of such a high school. The mayor will be right. I mean, he may be all county Crew Jones, but the point is he's in with the world TV champion, and defeating Onyx is damn near impossible last I checked. Onyx, um, like I said, been on a tear of defenses for that World Television Championship. Crew Jones! They're in control. Oh, there's the Heisman pose. How, uh, how sweet. Terrific. I'll get the trophy ready. And there's that pit in Onyx power slam. And if you get hit with that, your spleen's going to be ruptured. Well, Crew Jones, maybe he left his spleen in his car. It's like, um... Onyx has defeated guys like Kevin Northcutt, David Young, Adam Jacobs, Scoot Andrews, and a homicide in TV title defenses. He's been really untouchable. And the fact he's actually passed that ridiculous episode with Adam Jacobs as well as Jeff Bailey in that, oh, that uh, urine testing. Boy, I'm glad that's behind us now. What an embarrassment that was. Well, uh, don't count your chickens before they hatch. What is Jones wanting to do now? Oh, we're getting into some amateur wrestling. Hey, you're on my court, Dan. I mean that in the biblical sense. Okay. A little amateur wrestling here. Hey, try to score a touchdown now, huh, Jones? Waist lock takedown by Onyx. Does uh, Speedy Nelson have any uh, collegiate background himself? Oh, hell. Yeah, I think he played on the he's, chess team. He's four years from college. Waist lock again by Onyx. Mule kick back elbow by Crew Jones. An amateur mule kick, right? Drop kick. Down goes the world television champion. If you have to hand it to Crew Jones, we've been certainly handing it to him. The power in the legs of Jones shows more than a plenty power, but the power of Onyx is almost damn near insurmountable. And hopefully all county crew Jones is beginning to realize that. Onyx is on the top rope. High cross body. Impressive maneuver showing some of those junior heavyweight maneuvers left in him. Trinic enough here, huh? Crew Jones. Laying in right hands on Onyx in the corner, coming up in that main event. Of course, that hatred between Jimmy Rave and JC Daz gonna take that up to another level. Rave in the ring against Doctor's orders, and I'm sure Daz is salivating at the fact that Rave is injured. Also, Caprice Ice Coleman, two weeks ago on Wildside, he got the upset pinfall over Jason Cross, one of the hottest athletes in Wildside. Look at the sunset flip by Onyx. Crew Jones rolls through and steps on Speedy Nelson in the process. Some of the moves these wrestlers do week after week show so much momentum that unfortunately it seems to surprise them as much as it does their opponents sometimes. Drew Jones going for a permanent suplex, but Onyx uh, telegraphed that maneuver. Goes for a hip toss. Onyx reverses. What's this going to be here? A little backslide. There's a block count. So much for touchdowns this week on Wildside. Ladies and gentlemen, the winner of the match and still World Television Champion, Ronnie!